Hi guys! Okay, this is going to be my part one of my Sugar Sweet collection. Um, I was in town today and got some things. The rest of my collection is being delivered. I ordered it from the Mac Online and it should probably be here Monday or Tuesday, I think. But, I don't know. And I couldn't wait to show you this stuff, so I thought I'd just do two parts. Because if my videos are too long, it takes too long to upload anyway, so. That's what I got. First lot of stuff. I ended up getting three shade sticks and four lipsticks. Now this is my these are my first shade sticks ever. I have no shade sticks. I'm a shade stick rookie. So first one I got was Cake Shop. Um this is it here. I love the packaging of these. Is this like a permanent new packaging or are they gonna go back to black ones? I really like these. So this is um it's like a really silvery metallic -y green it's not even green enough to call green it's like more of a silvery with like a kind of greenish to it I don't know how well you'll be able to see that um but yeah that's really nice so I'm gonna be looking at people's um tutorials and stuff to kind of you know clue myself up and how to do these properly and what they'll look nice with so I'm gonna look out for some because these are my first ever ones and I don't know really. I've I've ordered um is it Aquavert, the green eyeshadow off the internet. Um which I've heard people say they've done like a tutorials on it and it's so pretty, so the next one I got was Butternutty. And this is really my kind of a colour. This is just a really nice beige kind of a colour. I put this, put it here. I don't know if you'll be able to see that. I just put it there. I don't think you can see that in the light because I'm using natural light and it's um it's kind of washing things out a wee bit today because it's not that sunny. But yeah, that's butternutty. I really like that one. And then I got one that I would never ever have bought if I hadn't watched Michelle 128's video on her sugar sweet haul and she got this and I just thought it was such a pretty colour and then I watched someone else who I'm just new to, I just subscribed to them so I don't really remember their name and they had this on with a different eyeshadow with it and it's so nice. It is red velvet and it's such a pretty pinky red. It's so pretty. Can you see, did you see that? It's so pretty. I'm so happy because I got the last one. I said to her, I think I want this. And she looked and she said, well, there's one left. And I was like, it's mine. It's all mine. Step away, everyone else, from the red velvet. So, got those three. Cake shop, but already red velvet. So happy. And lipsticks I got. I got four lipsticks. Um... I haven't got a lot of MAC lipsticks. In fact, I've only got one until I got these ones which is the creme, creme de nude, is it? Um, which is really nice, but only as like a base. You c I couldn't wear that on its own because it's so pale, it's very neutral, and it kind of washes out my lips too much. So I really can only use that if I'm wearing like a gloss on top of it. So I'm so happy I got these. The first one is again a color I would never have gone for, but it was sitting there, I thought I'd try it. And it's one of, I can't really pick a favorite because they're all so different, but I love it. It's Sweet Thing. And it's a, it's kind of a, um, a fuchsia kind of pink with, um, this looks like silver specks in it. I'm also seeing like a purpley blue, maybe that's just my eyes, but that's it there. That's it there. It is well pigmented, but it doesn't go on in a really dark way. It kind of goes on in a nice light way and you can... You can layer it really easily. The next one is Lollipop Loving. It's just so pretty. It's a um, corally colour with gold in it. And it actually reminds me of a lot of... Um, where is it? Nymphette Lip Gloss. Because it's that same kind of a corally colour with a gold kind of undertone to it, if that makes any sense. This one looks like... That. I don't know if you'll be able to see that. That's the sweet thing, and it's kind of there. 
I don't think, think you'll be able to see that because there's no sunlight, it's just like clouds and stuff, so it's kind of washing everything out a wee bit. Um, next one is Bubbles. My voice might sound a bit weird today because it's very sore. This is Bubbles. It's just a really, um, very whitey colour. It's To me it's very, 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 very pale pinky as well. It's not pure white. Um, I would never have got this one except that I've heard if you wear a bright lipstick and put this on top it can kind of don't tone it down a bit. It's also really pretty on its own. I tried it on in MAC on its own and it's a really nice neutral. Oh my god, my voice. And the last one is Saint Germain, which I've got on right now. And I am in love with this. I've wanted this for the longest time and then uh, I finally got it. Because I think this has been out in the UK for a while and it hadn't been out in the US, am I right there? And then it came out in the US with this collection, I think. And people went crazy for it. Uh, yeah, and then when I seen it, I was like, it's so bright, but it's really nice. It's so nice. So I'm so happy with that. Plus, if it's too dark, I mean, if it's too bright, plus it's a bit chalky, so what's nice is if you put pink fish. Pink fish. I always say pink fish. Pink fish on top of it. I'll kind of soften it. So pretty. So yeah, I'm so happy with what I got. Um, you know, I wasn't even supposed to be buying anything from this collection. Well, that went well. So... Yeah, I've ordered the two um, nail polishes, which I cannot wait for Peppermint Patty. I cannot wait for it. And two eyeshadows, um, Dear Cupcake and Aquavert. And I've ordered, I've, and, I've ordered a Grand Duo, I think, in Love Rock. So I'll show you that when it comes. And yeah, that's all for now. Bye.